this riff is in drop C tuning. So tune your strings to C, G, C, F, A and D to play along with the track. Start by sliding down the 5th and 6th string. Next play a D power chord on the 2nd fret of your 6th string and the 2nd fret of your 5th string. Relax your fret in hand finger to get a muted scratch. The riff continues with two B power chords on the 4th fret of your 5th string and the 6th fret of your 4th string. Next play two D major dyads with the 3rd in the bass using the 6th fret of your 6th string, the 7th fret of your 5th string and the 6th fret of your 4th string. Played together, the opening sequence sounds like this. Play the initial slide with a downstroke and then use a wide down up strumming motion throughout. The strumming pattern is down, down, up, down, up, down. The next phrase begins with two A power chords on the 7th fret of your 6th string and the 7th fret of your 5th string. Next slide the power chord up to the 10th fret to get a C power chord. Play the C power chord again and then slide to an F power chord on the 3rd fret. Play the F power chord again and then pull off to the open 5th and 6th strings. That creates a low C power chord. That would sound like this. Keep the strumming motion and play this phrase with up, down, down, down. So far that gives us... Repeat the opening sequence but leave out the initial slide. Next play two A power chords on the 7th fret of your 6th string and the 7th fret of your 5th string. Slide up to the 10th fret to get a C power chord. Play the C power chord again. Slide up to the 15th fret to get a high F power chord. Play the F power chord again and then pull off to the open 5th and 6th string for a low C power chord. Played together, that sounds like this. Strum this phrase with up, down, down, down. Once these sections are played, we repeat the first two phrases again. That will give us... Repeat the opening sequence but leave out the initial slide. Next play two A power chords on the 7th fret of the 6th string and the 7th fret of the 5th string. Slide up to the C power chord on the 10th fret of your 6th string and the 10th fret of your 5th string. Finally play four muted notes by relaxing the fretting hand fingers. Put together the end sequence sounds like this. The end sequence is strummed up, down, down, up, down, up. With all phrases played together, that sounds like this. <laughs>